Okay, chili heads and pepper freaks. See, I mixed it up a little bit that time. Um, Slade, uh, and I'm here to do another review. I recovered from yesterday's uh, super hots and um, I had a good night. Thought I was going to have capsaicin cramps, but I didn't. I, I uh, man, I had a good night. I slept like a baby. But anyway, Tonight I'm going to be doing a review for Joiner's Hot Pepper Powders. Uh, Chris was nice enough to send me some pods and asked me to review them for him. So this is what I'm doing for him. Anyway, tonight I'm going to be doing the Chocolate Scotch Bonnet. Um, it's a nice looking pod, man. It's uh, real smooth and it's a brandy kind of color. Um, not exactly chocolate. Um, so... Um, like I said, very nice color. So let's get into this thing. Nice amount of seeds. looks very gnarly on the inside hmm I like that smell I really do almost a fruity kind of smell you know a fruity peppery kind of smell I know y'all probably can't see in there but it's got a nice size placenta in there beautiful so we're going to cut this thing like this so I can get the seeds out of it. Had seeds going all the way down in the bottom there. Um, I don't know, maybe it's the way I cut it or something. Yep. them out. Still a beautiful color on that thing. Uh, the um, placenta was almost a brandy kind of color also. So here is the chocolate scotch bonnet. Mmm, nice flavor, sweet, thin skinned, Beautiful flavor, sweet, feel a little bit of heat on the tongue. A little bit of heat here in the back of the throat. I got a trash can over there I'll spit in. <laughs> I'll just spit it on the floor. Um, 
got a nice aftertaste to it. Um, a little bit on the burn on the bottom lips, throughout the tongue there, but nothing overpowering as far as the burn goes. Um, just a very little there on the back of the throat, but most of it's in the mouth. I can feel it on the um, you know gums a little bit. Still has a very very nice aftertaste to it. I really enjoy that. It's real good. It was a beautiful pepper. It was sweet chewing it. Nice after flavor, mild burn. Yeah, I really like that. I have to mark that one down on my uh, on my list. I got a couple of lists. I got one that must grow and then may grow. So that's definitely going on my may grow list. Like I said, it had a nice thin skin. Wasn't hard to chew up. Went down easy. Still got a little couple pieces in my teeth. But I'll save them for later. <laughs> but yeah, that, that is a very, very, very good pepper. So... Didn't get the uh, sal saliva glands kicking or anything. Don't have a runny nose or anything like that. The eyes aren't watering. So, I wonder how many more times I can say so. <sighs> All right. I guess this is going to be a short video. I guess I talked more than than uh, actually. Uh, did a review on the pepper before I started the pepper but um, I said very good pepper love the flavor man two thumbs up on the flavor you know uh, thumbs up on the heat there wasn't no real burn to it um, and yeah very very good peace I'll catch y'all on the flip side